こんにちは。Welcome to Campana s e j a p a n e s e i m m e g In this video, we are going to learn how to pronounce the Japanese R sound as in ラリルレロ。<laughs> The Japanese R sound is used in some languages. So, some of you already know how to pronounce the Japanese R. I can tell you right now, English speakers, you already know. The flap T sound, as in better, that's the Japanese R sound. Spanish speakers, You already know. The single R sound, as in quiero, that's the Japanese R sound. There's a list of languages that use the Japanese R. I mean, it's not the Japanese R. For you, it's probably the Spanish R or Portuguese R. But let me just say it's the Japanese R here. Anyway, There's a list of languages that use the Japanese R sound on the Wikipedia page. I'll put a link to it in the description. So go see if you have the same sound in your native language. For those of you who don't have the Japanese R sound in your native language, let me explain how to pronounce the Japanese R. The Japanese R Is officially known as a voiced alveolar tap sound. Voiced means your vocal cords here vibrate. Alveolar means here, your gamma ridge, where you tap your tongue tip. Tap means you literally. Tap your tongue tip against the gum ridge. This is your gum ridge. This is your tongue tip, like this. Da, 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 da. For now, forget about the D. Let's practice da, do, でろ。Connect the R sound with a, u, e, o. Repeat with me. だ、ど、で、ろ。だ、ど、で、ろ。だ、ど、で、ろ。The R sound in D is a little different since D is followed by the E vowel. For D, you tap the front part of your tongue against the gum ridge. That's the difference between the normal R and the R in D. This is the tip of the tongue. This is the front part of the tongue. This is the gum ridge, like this. D, 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 D. Now let's practice pronouncing da di du de do using some real words. Repeat with me. サラ、サラ、リス、リス、カエル、カエル、歴史、歴史、六、六、One last thing. Both hiragana and katakana are sets of phonetic characters. 
so it's quite important for you to be able to associate a sound with a corresponding character. So check out my hiragana playlist. Also, you can download hiragana worksheets like this on my Patreon page for free. So check out my Patreon page, the link in the description box below. Alright, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, leave me a comment. And if you like this video, please make sure to subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Ciao!